you guys out here have a couple traps set for muskrat. Had a few floater traps out here, but uh, they're obviously well fed because they weren't coming into it for about five days. So I've had to do some blind sets over in the far bank. This here is a drinking water pond for some folks. They're worried about the dugout being tunneled over into the storage over here. There's not much room here between the two and they're worried about how many muskrats were in here. So just uh, checking them and see what I got. Got one so far uh, the other day and I'll uh, give it a go here and see what I got again today. So this is the one trap that I replaced with what I had a floater set here. You can see the carrot there, it hasn't moved. Obviously they're not hungry. Um, got a trap down here, nothing in it. I might relocate it, I see some bubbles over here. Massively coming out of a hole perhaps, so I'll just check under the bank. Well, here's the tunnel trap. I've already had one out of here already, in a different location on this one pond and here is four in here it's not the most i got i've had nine in here once before that was a maximum but uh got four the gentleman had already taken out five previously in the fall and right now that makes a total of 10. i've taken out five this one week already uh, there may be some more in here they want them all gone to stop the tunneling over to the other pond. You wonder why or how I know that there's more muskrats in here? You got bubbles on the opposite end of the pond. Um, I wouldn't say they're starting here, but you can see they go along in a line here. Then over here, there's a massive amount right here. And right there is where I put one conibear, little 110. But for the moment, I need a little tunnel trap there, maybe to get a few more all at once to clean them right out. We'll see if there's anything there, if I get one. You see all the bubbles there. We'll see if the four that I took, if I got any more for tomorrow night. Talk to you later.